it's really back down that side in. Like someone up the yeah. bottom, cutting across those coolies. I feel like I feel like no, this I spot agree. could be just money. Dude, absolutely. I'm gonna beat you there. <laughs> <laughs> and hey, Mark, get set. <laughs> <laughs> That is so spindly. Nice. Just popped over the hill and found this guy lying here. Looks to be pretty decent. Looks fresh. Oh, beauty. Is that the other side right there? Nope. That's a different one. Oh, it's not too big. Not bad though. That might be the other side of this one. Great deep forks, maybe a few years old. Nice. Get another nice four point. That's all right. Awesome. Yeah, that's an old one. Looks like I found a little pocket here. Three within 50 yards of each other. Right on. Sounds a little better. Yep. Nice front fork. Down here. Good genetics. It's not every day you lay your eyes on a site like that. Woo-wee!
Well, I was just glassing over here. I'm going to put my binos away and I look down. Look at that. <laughs> oh my gosh. That thing is huge. Wow. Right here. Dude, that's like a 90 inch at least. That's okay, it. I'm recording. Okay, pro tip for all shad hunters, even though I have a backpack, carry a shed. When you especially when you're going through the bush, get the branches out of the way, there's always lots of spider webs. And it's also you never just, see the spider webs though. It's also good. Well, you just carry it in front of you. You don't have to see it if you have office man hands. And you can even cross fences with it. <laughs> Just so helpful. I like that pro tip. <laughs> <laughs> the other side. Just a nice, another nice shed though. Well, second day out here on this three-day trip and uh, just walking up to the first shed of the day. Looks like a nice little white tail, so let's pick them up. yards from that last dead head. Just spotted another one in here. That is a gorgeous, gorgeous buck. Beautiful A point. Couple extras. Beautiful deer. Little brows. Another 
chunk there. Wow. Ain't that interesting. Grief. That thing got obliterated. Literally chilling.